Now joining us from Tokyo is Jun Okumura, the Japan Senior Counselor uh, at Eurasia Group. Many thanks indeed for joining us, um, Okumura-san. If I can ask you first of all, um, your notes talk about Noda as not the most promising long-term choice, but the best player to pick out of the five. Well, um, the, um, there may have been uh, uh, better choices for uh, pushing forward the long-term policy agenda, which is not merely confined to the, uh, the long-term debt, but also to the long-term growth uh, po po uh, policies aimed at uh, long-term growth. Uh, but uh, in terms of po the politics, uh, he is probably best positioned to uh, keep the Ozawa people from open rebellion, uh, reach out to the opposition, uh, probably not for not a grand coalition ultimately, but a more cooperative uh, uh, position, uh, positioning from, say, the Komeito, which alone could assure an upper house majority. Uh, and but he is he is. Uh, 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 his uh, position as a fiscal hawk may have been somewhat exaggerated, but I, th I, I understand that that is very calming for the, uh, the market and, the, uh, and big business. Look at what he's done as finance minister. Three market interventions in, this, in the past year on the yen with little yes. impact. Yes. As prime minister, what impact do you think he's going to have? Um, well, uh, the... Uh, no, the, the Currency rate. Uh, I'm not. An, I'm not. I'm by no means an expert on this, but uh, there there are limits to the way, the extent to which uh, uh, the the Japanese government, the Bank of Japan, oh, uh, Ministry of Finance can uh, uh, actually control the currency rate because it is very much driven by events that are occurring outside of Japan. You referred so, to just now. Uh, um, uh, oh, sorry. Yes. You carry on, sir. Uh, but carry all, on. I think all. Oh, yeah. Excuse me. Uh, so, uh, I think the best we can ex expect uh, from the government in terms of uh, uh, the, the the currency rate would be uh, possible intermittent uh, uh, intervention, interventions to uh, uh, s s to uh, uh, ease the upper trajectory or the of uh, the end if that is what the uh, the market uh, if that is what the market demands we had a guest on earlier from the LDP Kono san he talks about nothing is moving forward it's a disaster politically and they're happy to sit down with the DPJ and discuss you know joining forces to deal with the crisis now you talked about just now earlier Noda's key thing is to keep the DPJ as fractious as it is together what are the what are the, the idea of talking to the opposition to the LDP and really joining forces? How likely is that? Uh, uh, the the uh, LDP joining forces with the LDP, uh, I think that is very unlikely because the, the LDP has a very different political agenda. It wants to force a snap election under a weak DPJ prime minister. Uh, the DPJ does not, but. Uh, in any uh, formal uh, coalition, the LDP would uh, uh, share in the blame if anything goes wrong. And if uh, things go right, then uh, the, uh, the DPJ will likely take the you know, just lion's share of the, of the, uh, the credits. So it, it doesn't Final really question for you. help. Yes? Sorry about this. A Final fine? question for you. Six prime minister in five years, how long do you see Noda San being in the post? And do you think there needs to be a snap election? I don't think there, I, I don't think there is a need for a snap election. Uh, because uh, there is no way that a snap election will change the situation in the upper house, by definition. And that is where the problem is. Uh, there is, uh, what the DPJ needs to do is to uh, draw in support uh, uh, on a, on a uh, uh, legislation by legislation basis. Uh, there is uh, the, uh, the Kumito, as I said, is uh, uh, the Kumito, I always like to say, is, a, is an urban middle class party. And so is the DPJ. 
uh, but, uh, but their constituencies do not overlap because the uh, Komeito is basically supported by uh, a, a Buddhist sect. So there's, there's, and the Komeito does not want a snap election. So there's natural political room for collaboration there. Okimura, sir, many thanks to you for joining us. Uh, Jun Okimura from Eurasia Group with 30 years of experience in the Japanese civil service.